What's up everybody out there in the beautiful, beautiful world we live in today, although it can be pretty shitty. Just know that you are who you are, be who you are, be yourself, stay positive, keep up the positivity, keep the peace, keep the love, show love back, do all that jazz, but in doing all that in your life, there's also, there's also one more thing that you should do. You know what that is? Check out Bulletproof Games, because you know I am who I am, and I am different from everybody else. And we are back with more Batman Season 2, The Enemy Within. This is where we left off last time, guys. And I want to wrap up this series in this video, so without further ado, let's get right into it. John has often mentioned he misses Arkham. Maybe he's hiding there. I thought of that. I'm afraid our own drone network has come up empty in a search of the asylum grounds and its catacombs. Hmm. Okay. So what about here? The agency searched the subway lair the pact had been using. <clears throat> they found nothing and raised what was left to the ground. Okay. So not there either. Also, guys, my uh, throat is still hurting. I don't know why, man. Like, I had like a sore throat like three or four weeks ago, and now it's back, and like, it sucks. I hate it. Uh, as for the GCPD, they've investigated John's other favorite haunt, the Stacked Deck. Interviews there yielded nothing useful, other than the fact John and a few of his regulars he's recruited to his cause haven't frequented the establishment in over a week or so. All right. Willie Deaver on the left, and that's <coughs> Frank Dumfrey. And also, I want to apologize for my coughing in this video. I might do it a lot, so my apologies. Waller set up a stake out of the funhouse after her agent's bodies were found. She has people there around the clock. John's gone to ground and in none of the usual places that we know about. I'm done. Hello. She's ready to kick some ass. My word. Well, you certainly look the part. Just wait till you see what it can do. Oh my god. Bruce, are you okay? Don't Never worry. better. It looks worse than it is. <clears throat> yes, you get used to him lying like this, unfortunately. Is this... Is this what happens to you all the time? Pretty much. Only on the bad days, don't worry about me. All the time, yeah. Alfred's right, Tiffany. This happens all the time. Me getting hurt or almost killed. And this time he's telling the truth. He's still a buff as shit, though. It's a long shot, but... The water tower. Where Joker set his ambush for the agency. It's still an active crime scene. With a little bit of luck. There may be something there I can use to track him. I'm coming with you. Oh, she got a drone. Chemical sniffers, advanced sensor suites, early warning defense nodes, all with same capability directly to your power. <clears throat> it scans and catalogs evidence in a nanosecond. Maybe even faster than the back computer. Ooh. It's even got some defensive options. Non-lethal, of course. Ah, uh, take it with me. It sounds like a plan. I won't let you down. I won't let either of you down. Why not? Let's get to work. She's been trying to, you You'll know, need these. be a part of the team, so why not For give her pain. a little taste? To numb the pain, gotta numb the pain with the painkiller. You, uh, you're forgetting something. Mm-hmm. That's right. The mask. Alfred's always concerned. Poor Alfred, you know? He just chills in that basement all day, just waiting for Batman to come back. To see his ass beat up. I'm really digging it though, man. I'm really digging this episode so far. 
I really think it's about to pick up. It's just like, I feel like it's setting up for something big, so. It's got to, right? It's the finale. The finale. I wonder if there'll be a season three, so we'll see if there's a cliffhanger or not at the end. Nervous. Isn't everyone before their first crime scene? How do you... I mean... How do we do this? You take the lead? I ain't gonna do like that. Just watch what I do. Act like you're scary. Watch what I do. And keep cool. Easier said than done. You'll get the hang of it. How do I sound? <laughs> Oh, God. That's not how it's supposed to sound. That needs some work. Yep. Might, might need to, um, you know, tone down the voice a little bit. But I like it. Batman. I didn't expect to see you here. And oh, really? Is... She's with me, detective. Damn, she gave her a mean-ass look. We the might fuck? not be able to give you a lot of time. With Lala kidnapped and me getting canned, no one's sure whose jurisdiction this crime scene falls under. The agencies or the GCPDs. So for now, let's go ahead and say it's yours, all right? My people are here to help however they can. Gordon, I appreciate the assist. Yeah, sure thing. Love you, Gordon. What Gordon? Hold on. Never. After the pack separated, Joker had to find somewhere else to hide. There could be clues here that tell us where that is, and where he may have taken Waller. In the Batman universe, Gordon is probably one of my favorite, uh, favorite characters in the Batman universe. So I love Gordon. He's just always awesome, no matter so how. this partnership between you and Batman, when did that happen? It's new. Okay, time to trek. Venom trail. Drone. Bane's venom. His suit was punctured. It's everywhere. Is it useful? No. Not in finding Joker. I'll add it to ignore on the drone search filters. Cool. Car? Forensics ran it through the system. Found it was stolen from the stack deck a few weeks ago. I recognize it. It's been customized since then. Little put. My drone can analyze it. Just point and I'll shoot. All right. First huh. seat. This car is hotwired. It's a mess. Well, you think a guy like him would have stolen a car before? It's not that bad. Well, if you say so. Paint job. Get some details on this paint. Funny. Doesn't look like a rush job. Because it's not. The drone sees a body shop quality strip below the top layer. The paint uses a stripping solvent that hasn't met compliance standards since. I'll run a check on manufacturers in the area, see who's recently been dinged for safety regulations. This much data, we're gonna need something to narrow it down. Like a name. Kids are natural at this. Yeah, she's doing what happened here? God's work Joker out here. Joker hit Bane with his car. Eesh. I'll be out of insurance. <laughs> Little pudding. Custom plates. Probably didn't get this done at the DMV. Lil Puddin? <laughs> Must be his way of remembering his time with Harley. Harley. Hmm. Someone was thirsty. What do you think? Wanna run DNA? Yeah, I was about to say, no. yeah. We already know who it belongs to. Well, yeah. No, no. I miss this, you know. You and me raking over a crime scene. Uh, I messed it up, didn't I? Now, in the early days when we were chasing you, not realizing you were one of the good guys, you and I came to an agreement. Yep. We worked together to make Gotham safer. 
That's how it's always been. I lost my head the other For the day. most part. I want you to know I'm sorry. I cracked, like I said I would when Waller first moved in. You were just doing what you thought was right, Jim. There's nothing to apologize for. You're a good man for saying that. I'm a good man. Yeah, I love myself. I know who I am. My boy Logic. I got Bobby Tarantino too stuck in my damn head. So every time someone That's says something, something interesting, it's a faint signal. I can just find lines to uh, rap about or sing about because I've been listening to that shit all day and night. Overnight. Just get. Let's get, let's get, let's get into it. Must have lost it after he went into a frenzy against Bane. John Doe thought he could take on Bane? He's not half bad in the fight, actually. Yeah, Joker. Low key can't Joker. fight. Just check out Injustice 2. You know what I'm saying? Nothing of note. What do we have here? The Collar. controller to the shock collars that Waller is using on the pact. <clears throat> Damaged. Can you isolate the signal from this device? Sure, but why? I've seen what these collars can do. Might come in handy. My handy dandy notebook. Oh, going up the stairs. That's cool. Hmm. Not sure Riddler would like the new decor. This Joker guy going nuts. I heard it started with Riddler's murder, but he's blaming Waller for it. Wouldn't actually surprise me. Riddler's murder? Really? But maybe it was always just a matter of time before he snapped. <laughs> Okay, what else? Banner. Welcome, Agency Pigs. <laughs> Here I thought that was our nickname. <laughs> Joker Ray. A maker's mark. WD. Willie Deaver, Joker's associate. Yep. What do you have on him? Machinist by trade. With a storied employment history. He's been fired from almost every factory and chemical plant in Gotham. Has a drinking problem, apparently. Hmm. Chemical plants. Huh. Let me cross-reference Willie Deaver's former employers with the paint used on Joker's car. Damn, she's good. Ace Chemicals. Their main plant was shut down last year after the city cited them for multiple safety violations. Because of the paint. The plant's been abandoned ever since. Perfect hiding spot. Gotcha. We found him. Well, well, well. Oh, God, What's here we go. Then? A bat and a walking mustache trespassing on my crime scene. You escaped. <laughs> you got it all wrong, baddie boy. I'm here on agency business. What? For the love of God. That's right. <laughs> I'm one of the good guys now. Oh, God. So hand over everything you found before I knock out those pearly whites. In the name of the law. In the law. Batman, we don't have time to mess around with this clown. Make time, Kava. I don't you answer to you. Orders from me now. I don't take orders from you, Quinn. Stand down. Let me show you how things work around here now, Batsy. This is Agent Quinn. Suppressing fire. Are you really? Are... This shit's crazy, man. I love the different storytelling they've done. Like, this is definitely not a typical Batman story. A lot of cool shit they added in this. These suits are convinced I can save their director from Big Bad Joker. They'll do anything for Does me. Does she get a haircut? So all you gotta do is tell me where John took her so I can get back to my job. After all, Johnny Boy and I are doing... No chance in hell you got. No you chance. In with the wrong crowd. No chance. I'm not telling you anything. <laughs> Can't say I'm surprised. <laughs> and here I thought being diplomatic would work with you people. Oh well, I'll try something you can understand. I need 
Hey, you cops can't just shoot people like that. So, so. <laughs> I love it. What's the girl gotta do to get some? The hell? Yep. Get over here. Uh oh. I can hack those collars in my sleep. <laughs> no. Nope. Oof. Throw ass. You son of a. Pop. Got it, sir. Wouldn't it be so fucking crazy if he just pulled the trigger like, whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> he just point point killed him. That'd be some crazy shit. What the hell do you think you're doing? Sending you off to Blackgate, where you belong. <laughs> oh, please. The agency isn't going to let me sit in a cell. I'm an asset. I'm going to get what I want, and there's not a damn thing. Yeah, she has a whole lot of assets, you if you know what I mean. You can't touch me, Bats. I'm the one in control here. Even if you escape this, you'll never be free. I will hunt you down till you pay for everything you've done. You don't scare me. I've outrun you before. I'll do it again. She will. That's how she is. Go She's a sneaky bitch. Carves up Waller. I'll clean up this mess. Have your people hold back until I call them. Waller's life may depend on a stealthy approach. Batman. Good hunting. He got dinged up. I hope we get to get to kill Waller in the in the end. Damn, I fumbled those words up bad. I just got a cough coming up. <clears throat> there we go. I'm good now. For about 30 seconds. Man, my throat, man, it's just like bothering me so much it's not like super super bad it's just that it's just, it's just annoying every time i swallow it just hits that spot it's like oh it hurts fuck cough drops ain't helping medicine i'm taking ain't helping might need to see a doc ace chemicals Uh, the painkillers. They did come in handy. <laughs> so Joker has Waller. <laughs> I love that laugh. Joker and Waller. Doesn't look like he's hurt her. Not yet. I want him to hurt her. I'm in the rafters, out of sight. Say the word if you need help. Thanks. Bruce, I know you and Waller have your differences, but she doesn't deserve this. Yes, she does. She deserves all of this. Surprise! I take complete responsibility. Louder. So the camera can pick it up. <laughs> Took you long enough. Batman! Thank God! I mean, I assumed you'd be okay. You're Batman, for Pete's sake. But still, are you okay, buddy? I was really worried about you. Never better. I'm fine. Of course you are. No way would a couple pesky bombs take you out. <laughs> Things got crazy on that roof, huh? I had to do something. Waller was about to walk away. But get this, I'm this close to getting Waller to admit to every terrible thing she's ever done. And when that's over, I'll deliver her punishment. It'll, of course, have to reflect the enormity 
Gosh, Lord, that I don't like none of these right options. I want her to die. Really don't like you. Stop glaring. <laughs> you know, I I don't know why you're not more into this. Think of everything she's put you through. Everyone is disposable to her. Even her own agent. I know I've made mistakes. You try to do the right thing, but there's always a cost. Just ask your pal Batman there. He'll say the same thing. I do what I do for a reason. I'm not ashamed. Don't play innocent. I play to win. When I lose, good people die. <laughs> You're totally right. She sucks! Let's keep the show rolling. <laughs> your excuses you didn't mean for people to get hurt. Collateral damage, yada yada yada. But there's one crime that can't be excused. You killed the Riddler! And then you tried to pin it on me! I didn't kill him. Like I said. It was you! You killed Riddler! Say it! I will not. If there's one thing I learned by watching you, violence solves a lot of problems. Yes, it does. Throw battery, single Tiffany, shock Joker. Um, how about I do none of those things? <laughs> oh, she's gonna do it anyway. Damn it. Damn it, Batman! Stay out of my way! You need a distraction. <laughs> Get my confession. For a second, I thought that was, um, what's his name? Aquaman. The way boss talked about you, I thought you'd be bigger. It kind of looks like the guy that plays Aquaman and, um, Justice League. Kind of. Please move. She dies. Please move. Really, really hard to do things your way. I want to just slice her throat right here, right now. Do it. I can see that you're trying, but this isn't the way. Don't call but... me. You're just saying things, trying to trip me up, just like Lawler. She justifies her crimes. Says they're for the greater good. Just like you. You both use that word, justice, as an excuse. So you can do whatever you want. I thought you and I were two threads in the same stitch. I'm nothing like Waller. You're either lying or stupid, Bats. I don't know why I didn't see it sooner. Trying to do things your way was a mistake. Waller killed Riddler. <gasps> and she deserved death! It wasn't Waller! Tiffany? I can't let someone else pay for my crimes. Whoa. Waller didn't kill Riddler. I did. What? I know it was wrong. <clears throat> now. What the fuck? Uh, God, are you kidding me? <laughs> These are the people you want to protect not at all i should kill them both do it please everyone here is guilty <laughs> this is this is a joke i ain't gonna say that amanda waller is innocent no she's not true i told you i didn't kill him i used a drone and these there's your proof you want to sacrifice yourself for Waller? Then go ahead. Oh, fuck. Just hold on. Murder is wrong. Trust the system. Violence isn't the answer. People just pick and choose what they believe. And you're no different. I'm pressing up. Oh, shit. Of course, I'm saving Joker. He's the main one I want to save. <laughs> I got her. Oh. 
He's running. And he's down. Hands where we can see them. Oh yeah. After everything we've been through together. So oh, sorry, bro. This is how it is. I didn't want it to end like this. Telltale's making me do it. Telltale's making me do it, Joker. I'll get you help. I won't abandon you. You want me to go back to the beginning? To Arkham? It all started. I've come so far since then, Batman. Because of you. I believed in you, Batman. Like I never believed in anything. And it was all a lie! Yep. Oh, we Oh my god! Oh my god! What the... Oh, whoa, 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 what the fuck? John. <laughs> Holy shit. It's Joker! <laughs> I love it. I fucking love it. That was so sick. He straight murdered the fuck out of them. <laughs> oh, he's all, yeah, he's full Joker now. It's like, no doubt. I don't want to throw it. Nope. I died, didn't I? I don't want to kill him. Well, I don't think I'll kill him, but... I just want to see what happened if I didn't press it. That happens. So I guess we gotta, like, fight. I don't want to, though. He's my best friend. He's super quick. Oh, we having a battering fight. Damn. He's, he's loving the shit out of this. <laughs> Must have hit him in his funny bone. Going up? Uh oh. Body slam. That wasn't really a body slam, but okay. Oh, damn. Yeah, Joker's more brains than bronze. He already figures out a way out of everything. Today. <laughs> uh oh. Bicycle kick. Oh. Oh, he's got something in his hand. Shit. No. This is sick, though. The fact that he's laughing at everything is fucking crazy. Oh! Holy fuck! 
Do the other hand. Max voltage. Damn. Of course. Like a, a true friend? Of course. Of course you were my friend. Yep. <laughs> That's real. <laughs> you are one messed up guy. <laughs> Joker would never forget that. Damn. It's all love at the end of the day, Joker. Telltale made me do it. Hashtag Telltale made me do it. <laughs> but no, I understand though. Like most of the time, I'm just joking around. Like I understand it had to go this way. But it would be pretty like cool and um, interesting if they like just went a different route with it and Batman just teamed up with Joker and they both just start slitting throats, you know. But it's not it's not the Batman way. I understand. I'm just saying it would, kind of, it would come. It would be kind of cool if it happened. Just saying, that's all. That's all I'm saying. It's not that deep. Must be in a yeah. Amulets. You too. What the fuck? They smoking again? I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. Batman led the charge. I wish he would have died. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. Didn't want to. Please tell me. I guess Please. that puts me in your debt. Doesn't mean I like you. Doesn't make you special, Waller. It certainly doesn't mean I like you. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Oh, God. Batman and I have some unfinished business. Joker should have killed I'll go check you. Check on Joker's transfer. Make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? We can all play nice now. The bad guys in cuffs. I can't make any promises. I'm gonna tear her ass off. Anything she's gonna offer, I'm gonna shut it down. Hey, you don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Thank but God. He's still talking. Tiffany Fox. Riddler's death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really Save it. gained a solid footing. I don't want to hear it, Waller. Save it for your bosses in DC. They don't give a damn how the sausage gets made, as long as they still get their cookout. This is me and you talking about where things went wrong. I just came here to round up the pact, quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen, everything I did, I did for the greater good. Here we go. To protect Gotham to uphold the law. You're so to full make of it. The world a safer place. You're so full of it. You caused all of this. Yes, she I've did. I've seen the file. The pact would never have come to Gotham if you hadn't kept Lotus running. Take a look in the goddamn mirror. 
I'm bitch, what? Part in this. But what Who? about you? Hold up. Who the fuck do you think you she talked to? So high and mighty. At the end of the day, you're just a rich guy with all the toys beating up on lunatics. I deal with criminals who threaten my city. Put your so ass. Far up your own ass. You can't see the truth. Whoa, please you're put your ass. Any of them. Get up. Had you paid the minute Grab all away. Office. Get out of my town. She started listing off your pals. All those friends. This conversation is over. Bye, bitch. <laughs> Jim's loving it. So, yep, that was great. Oh, man, I, I wish they would have given me a prompt to punch her. Just one good time. Just pop. <laughs> like, shut the fuck up. I ain't got time to hear your dribble. Got better things to do than talk to yo ass. That was a cool fight though, me and Joker. I liked how it ended, I like how all the stuff we said. It's pr pretty crazy that she was the one that killed um the Riddler though. But she might be a, become a villain in the next one, I don't know. But maybe not, because she was pretty cool, like she helped us out, so I don't know. But it's crazy to think that she knows Bruce Wayne now, so. She seems alright though, she just wanted to kill the river. Tiffany, we need to talk. Someone's yeah, in trouble. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. <laughs> My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? Um, yeah. Pretty much. I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. I've been dreading this moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. You should be afraid. I always find out. You should be afraid. I'm sorry. I, I know what I did was wrong. But Riddler tore my family apart, Bruce. My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness. But I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless. Like my life was crumbling around me. Well, I mean, I wanted I to kill to Waller, so. Revenge is an impulse, one to be checked. I can't condone it. But I do understand it. I do understand. Thank you. That means a lot. I couldn't bear it if you despise me. So, where do we go from here? Let's fall. I'm suppose kidding. <laughs> this puts me on your most I'm kidding. List. Rather than us working together. You need a mentor. You need to face justice. I ain't gonna do that to her. If you want to fill your father's shoes, you need to learn right from wrong. You need someone to teach you. You're giving me a second chance? Think of it more as a sentence. You'll have to work hard for your redemption. I, mean, I already told her I understand, so sending her to justice would be like flip flopping. I promise I won't let you down. Then let's get started. It'd be cool to have her as a sidekick, you know? I don't wanna. <laughs> no problems with for the. Pretty cool. That was a dope scene. I really like that scene between them. Because I can't say nothing. Like, if they gave me the chance to kill Waller at any moment, I would have done that shit. 
I wouldn't even hesitate. Wayne Manor. This shit ain't over yet? Damn. Oh, we ain't, we ain't hit the cliffhanger yet. Something's gonna happen with Joker or something else gonna happen with a new villain. Is that Alfred? For a second, I thought he had blue hair. It looks like he does. I was going to write a note, but I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Oh, he's leaving. Anymore. Then again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? Saying goodbye. The fuck? I'm leaving. Then just leave. <laughs> just take a vacation. I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Like we talked about. Some place in the sun, on the other side of the world from Gotham. That'd be good for me, you know? I'd rather think this vacation will be permanent. No. But why? This war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. So just be my... Nah, I can't do this without... Come on, Alfred. You know I can't do what I do, what we do, without your help. Well, maybe you don't have to do it at all. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore, at least not to me. Now everything has become so gray. <laughs> gray? Talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. Well, it worked, didn't it? Yep. In a manner of speaking. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away, inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes, it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. There's a way to look at it, if you think about a it. dreadful thought, I know, but one that keeps me awake at night. You must be drunk. How many whiskeys is that, Alfred? <laughs> Not nearly enough. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. We put her in danger on her first day, dodging machine guns at a crime scene. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. That's a price I'm willing to pay. In war, there are always casualties. But it doesn't mean you give up the fight. I've served in my share of wars, Bruce. More even than you. There are some fights you cannot win. One thing is for certain. My tremors are gone. <laughs> well, that's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The tremors. The fainting spells. Don't blame me for your hands, Alfred. You knew what you were getting into. <sighs> no, no, I'm sorry, Bruce. That's not what I meant at all. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you. Not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Okay, maybe I am more like my father than I want to admit, but our paths are different. Can't you see? Different. The paths may diverge, but they end in the same place. Face down in an alley, shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself, along with everything he loved. I enabled him, 
like I've been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. I failed you, and for that I'm sorry. We failed each other. We failed each other, Alfred. My obsession, my relentless effort to stop crime. I should have seen the harm it was causing you. A father takes care of his son, Bruce. Guides him through the world. Not the other way around. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. Damn, this is crazy. Wasn't expecting this at all. Uh oh, the bat symbol. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. What's gonna happen? Give up, Batman. Get up. Give up, Alfred. What? Wait, hold on. What? I will give up, Alfred. I mean, no. Uh, yeah. You're right now. It's who I am. I will always be Batman. Yeah, of course. And that will never change. I know. Rubbish goes out on Tuesday. And there's lasagna in the freezer. I'm sure you'll manage. I, I feel so bad, but like, if Alfred wants to leave, man, it's like, that's on him. Like, I can't, I can't just stop being a Batman. It's like. <clears throat> wow. That's how we ended it, huh? That's how we go to end it, huh? There's gotta be after credits, right? Right, really? There's gotta be after credits. Oh no. No after credits? Over the season your relationship has been affected by your actions and decisions within the story. Evaluating your relationship choices, evaluating your relationship choices. Okay. Your choices are ready. Harley Quinn. You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. You and zero percent players told her you would bring her to justice. Hard to cool delight in getting you to say you were part of the pack if her activity she was as furious as the pack abandoned. Alright. Alright, let's see what Thunderbolt! I'm the whole goddamn hurricane. I'm glad I got hear her damn voice again. You and four percent of players are making it a stalemate with her. Okay. Well, was furious that you trampled her over the witness and ordered her to surface in Gotham. She appreciated you reaching out to her after you first fight with Bane. Didn't mean to do that. My boy! I like how this. Safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I like how they're doing this though. It's pretty cool. You and 59% of the players accepted Gordon's apology, of course. I mean, the majority on that one. Everybody loves Gordon, right? Oh, God, here we go. Catwoman. She's pissed. I weighed my options, and what can I say? I don't like to lose. You and 35% of the players made no deal with Waldo and Selena's behalf. Yep. I did do that. <laughs> Tiffany Fox. I yep. won't let you down. Oh, nice. I'm in the majority. You and 8% of the players took Tiffany under your wing. Nice. I like that purple, too. It's dope. Oh. A vest. I'm really insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? Yeah, I forgot about that. I did ask her to work for me. Yeah, I liked her. Like, I didn't like her at first, but she grew on me. You have 54% of the players asked her to come work. Okay. Okay. If a man hides in plain sight for that long, oh. does he forget who he really is? 
I I'm the majority, guys. You and 58% of players let Africa go rather than giving up Batman's crusade. It's how can you give up Batman's my thing? Like, I really love Alfred. Alfred's the dude. Like, he's the dude. Like, he he's always there for Batman no matter what. But, I mean, it's just... How can this game go on if I'm not Batman? <laughs> Would it be Bruce Wayne all the time? I was like, no, it can't happen. As long as Bruce, Wayne, Bruce Wayne's alive, he's gonna be Batman. You know? That's just how it works. It's like, that's him, like... He saves Gotham from all the crime. So, that's how I felt. Oh! The Joker. They're two threads in the same stitch, bound together, even under strain. Cool. That was a good line. You and 54% of players told Joker you were still friends. Of course. I feel like a lot of people went my route, I want to say, like, becoming friends with Joker, because it's such a cool thing, in my opinion. Like, something that's never been done before, I, I want to say. It could probably happen in the comic I don't know about, but this game, man, it's like, I've seen it for the first time to see it play on the screen, it was so good. Shout out Anthony McGruber, man, who plays the Joker. He is fucking awesome at playing the Joker. Like, holy fuck. What a great job, dude. Bravo. Shout out to Troy Breaker for playing Bruce Wayne slash Batman. He was great as well. Both of them, man. Bravo. Like, congrats on this, man. Y'all killed it. Did you say Willie or Agent Harrison? Say percent of the players say Willie. Free Willie! Did you take Tiffany into the field with you? You and 77% of the players took Tiffany out to the field. Oh yeah. In the majority. You and 68% of the players refused to hand over Joker to Waller. I could not do that? Hand over. Oh no way. Hand over Joker to Waller. Oh yeah, I didn't want to do that. Did you give up the cow so Alfred would stay? You and 58% of the players chose never to give up being Batman. 5% of the players refused to hear Alfred's last words. Damn, that 5% is fucking harsh. 36.3% uh, of the players told Alfred you would give up being Batman. Crazy. Which Joker did you defeat? You 55% defeated Vigilante Joker. Pretty awesome. Didn't know he could be something else though. Oh, let me go back and see. You have 14 percent of players hesitated during Bane's attack. You don't said it, but it took me out. Oh, we always saw that, yeah. Okay. Thought that was different. Photos collected. <laughs> Look at that catalog. <laughs> I love it. Squad! <laughs> Continue. Is there after credits? Will there be after credits? Please. There has to be a little bit more for season three. Let's see it, Telltale. I know you have it. Oh, here we go. Here we fucking go. Arkham Asylum. I knew it. Is he back? For John Doe. Uh, oh. Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> what? Bruce. This is. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so they will continue this shit. I'm all for it, bro. They continue the friendship with Joker and Bruce Wayne, bro. I am all for it. I am all for it. Let's fucking go. Get five free comics. I don't know he's waiting. Register for Telltale Counter see five free comics. I'll do that later. That'd be pretty cool to get five free comics, though. Uh, I don't think I have a Telltale account, do I? If I would have said yes, it'd take me to all kinds of bullshit and have to sign this, sign that, whatever. I don't want to go through all that shit right now. Put my damn street address and all that. But, dude! Bravo, man. Bravo. What an episode. Really enjoyed it. 
uh, kind of got slow in the middle. I was like, I really didn't like the whole, like, I mean, I didn't, I ain't gonna say I didn't like it. It was just like, I just wanted to get into it, you know? I didn't like the whole, like, investigating and tracking. I was like, we've already done that in, in the beginning. Like, let's get away from that stuff. Like, let it all be, like, show me a little something more. But, um, that part is kind of like, this is kind of slow for me. As I just wanted to pick up the pace a little bit more since it was the finale. I wanted it all to be bonkers, but it was cool. Um, Besides from that, though, the whole, like, final scene, like, the final battle with Joker was fucking awesome. All the scenes after that, too, man, with Waller was cool, fucking giving her shit, talking to Gordon. Sorry about that. Uh, talking to, um, who, Tiffany, talking to Alfred. That Alfred and Bruce Wayne scene, dude, that gave me some chills, bro. I was like, I was feeling that. I was like, fuck, this is really happening. She was gonna be Batman, but the fucking after credits though. Let's talk about the after credits though. The after credits though. He's seeing the picture of him, Batman. It's like, damn. Still miss my boy. Then, hey, John, you got a visitor. It's crazy that he's back to being John Doe, but anyway, since he's back in Asylum or back in Oregon. And, um,. <laughs> and it's like Bruce like he was so surprised but so happy to see him I was like oh shit they continue this shit let's fucking go because I told him I was still his friend you know like I told him like the truth like it's me and you to the end dog like I hate that you all are like this but don't you be killing folks also one of my favorite parts the whole entire season across both seasons was him just joking just straight murdering those three agents. I was like, whoa! I did not see that coming. It was like, you just don't see that in bat in a Batman like story. Like that, not that killing is not like happening at all in a in the Batman universe. It's just the fact that that it was that graphic and that brutal. Like I wasn't expecting him to straight knife a dude up the neck and through his fucking mouth. I was like, whoa! And fucking slice that chick's throat. And I was like, okay, okay, hold up. This shit's fucking crazy. Joker just went full on Joker, and I was like, that's fucking awesome. And the fact that every time I punched him, he was doing a laugh. Like it's like just being him and this. Oh, love the Joker, man. One of my favorite villains of all time. I feel like everybody says that. It's because he's so dynamic. He's so fresh he, all the time. Like every time Joker's on the screen, you want to listen to everything he says. You want to see everything he's doing. Like I don't know what it is. It's like him. Ah, uh, he's just such a great villain. And it would be possible that Anthony McGruber, man, Anthony McGruber. What a fucking wow! What a like I said, great job, man. Great job on being the Joker in this game. Like. He stole, the, like, he basically stole the show for me, because, like, I don't know, man, like, he might be my favorite Joker out of the video game world, I ain't saying, like, I ain't comparing to movies or TV, you know, like, I'm just saying, like, out of all the video games I play with Joker in it, I think he's the best so far, I want to say, like, I really enjoyed his Joker, like, I really enjoyed it, what he did and what how the writing was with Telltale, how they rid him, like, it were, it, it was really well done. Really well done. Let's kind of give me a little review. I know I'm like, you know, talking a lot and it's 58 minutes already in and I don't want to go over an hour. So just wanted to give you my thoughts about it. And I've been playing Far Cry 5. I decided not to record it because I just don't have time to record hardly any anymore. So public service announcement. I'll probably say it again, but I uh, just want to let y'all know that. I probably won't be recording a lot, like the big games, like Far Cry 5 and all the huge open world games, just because they take so fucking long to rec like to record and do walkthroughs. Like I had to stop dishing out um, videos from Assassin's Creed because I saw like the more I, I posted, like the less views it got. It's because I don't know. I just feel like when people just watch something for too long, they just get tired of it. So like the big open world games, it just take forever to beat. So I'm like, well, there's no sense of me like doing like eight or nine videos and people just fall off of it anyway then go watch it all the way to the end so i ain't gonna do like the big open world stuff there's more more i want to do if I, the um mainly i do the uh just story driven like short stuff like telltale and story stuff and um some sports games i ain't playing WWE though stop asking me to play fucking WWE 2k whatever i hate them damn games i really do like 
they frustrate me to the core. Like the gameplay is awesome. I love the gameplay. I love all the people in it. I love what it's about. I love wrestling. You all know this, but just saying, I don't want to play it because the story mode has just not been good to me. And I and I'm a story driven. I'm a story guy. All right. Anyways, guys, stay different from everybody else. You are witnessing greatness, and I am out. Peace.